What's up guys, we're out here in Florida and trying to kind of build the bag, having some fun, playing some rounds out here with all the guys, filming some content. And this is the bag I've been playing full rounds with. So I'm gonna go ahead and show you guys what's in it. I've got three CT focuses with some like rubber blends so they have a little bit more grip. I just love the way these feel in my hand. For more overstable shots, I have this Pro D Challenger OS. Just really handles a lot of torque on the backhand and some easy touch sidearms. Really liking that disc. And then for straight putter shots, this Luna has been flying great for me. Nice, consistent, straight finish. Moving on to the mid ranges, I got this Glow Z Zone. Just super consistent, overstable up shots with sidearm. I don't really backhand this disc at all, but it fits in the hand great with her sidearm. And then overstable backhands, I have the Malta. Very consistent, hands a lot of torque. And then I have two buzzes. I have this four time buzz. Handles a lot more torque, can hyzer flip it to straight and don't have to worry about it turning right. Handles fights in the wind better as well. And then this is gonna be my main buzz, my touch buzz. Anywhere inside of 350 feet, I'll probably be throwing this disc, honestly. I can shape it any way I want. I'm really, really liking this mid-range a lot. And then I have one Buzz SS, just for those consistent turnover lines. Really trustworthy disc, Heiser flip to straight, using that for a lot of the shots. Uh, really like the Buzz SS as well. Fairway drivers, I have these two Raptors are gonna be my sidearm Raptors. This one has a bit more straight out of the high end flight, and then it cuts back at the end, of course, like a Raptor. And then this is just my Beefcake, super overstable Captain's Raptor. Gonna be throwing this one a lot, really enjoy this disc. And then I have ESP Captain's Raptor. This is gonna be strictly backhand. Just like the way it has the higher shoulder, fits in my hand better for backhands. And just those consistent backhand flex shots are just spike hyzers inside of 400-ish. Uh, and then next for my straighter fairway drivers, I carry the Athena. I got it in three different types. I have the Test Flight Athena. This one's pretty overstable, can handle a lot of power on a hyzer, just flip up straight, and always has that consistent left finish. This one's a bit more straight. I'm gonna be throwing this one a lot. Just touch Annie to flex shots, hyzer flip to dead straight. Uh, this is definitely becoming my favorite disc in the bag, at least one of them. Then I have this Proto Athena, which is super understable for an Athena. I've been liking it for tight hyzer flip shots to the woods or even the occasional roller with this disc. It's very easy to shape shots with this particular Athena. And for my last fairway driver, I have this Crystal Onyx. Super overstable, handles a lot of power. Just, I can really get on it on an Anheuser and it won't ever turn over, it'll always fight out of it. Really excited to use this in windier shots, anywhere from 425 to 450-ish. And next we have the distance driver. I carry three Venoms, two ESP and one Z. This one's my super overstable meat hook, just spike hyzers. That's all I'm gonna be using this thing for. Backhand, headwind shots, just super consistent, overstable. Then I have this test flight. It's a bit straighter. I like this one for sidearms because it's a bit more flat and it holds the straight line a bit longer, but always has the meaty right finish to it. And then I have this ESP super pop top, super overstable. This is gonna be my main driver for the season. By far, just pop it on Anheuser. It's always gonna fight out. Heiser flips in the wind. This is gonna be my main distance driver for sure. And then I have one force. This is just super overstable force, long range overstable shots I'm probably gonna use this for. 
backhand and side arm. Really like the way it flares at the end of the flight so I can get a bit extra distance with that skip. I have another force here actually. This one's also super overstable, same flight, but just feels better in the hand for sidearm than that one does. And then for super distance, I have the nuke. I have this ESP nuke, it's very overstable. I can throw it as hard as I want, hyzer. It'll never dump over to the right. This is gonna be like my main distance driver probably for just bombing one as far as I can. I have this TI nuke. I'm probably gonna be using this one for more of tailwind shots, but not really sure yet. That one's kind of replacing it overall, so this one is pretty much just a backup for that one. And then I have this Ezra Adelhold nuke. This is just for long, super long shots. If I have tailwind and then rollers occasionally and then bomb their sidearms, and that's what I'm using for that. All right guys, those are the discs I'm gonna be throwing for the first part of the season and I'm super excited to see how they play and even more excited to play for Discraft. <laughs>